For a seated band calf raise, you wanna have your leg extended so that you can focus on doing the calf raise exercise, which is essentially like a plantar flexion motion where we are using both the soleus, the lower um, section of the calf and the gastroc, which is the upper section. We wanna be able to use both parts of the calf and we're trying to add a little bit of resistance to this exercise. And this is usually a good option if you've never strengthened the calves before or you're recovering from some kind of a lower leg injury or you've got a tendinopathy, something like that. So you're seated with the leg extended in front of you um, or elevated in some way. So there's no weight on the exercise. The emphasis here is there's no body weight on your calf. You're gonna place a band around the ball of the foot and this can get tricky depending on the type of band you have because you don't want the band to pop off and hit you in the face. So if you can, try to get that band nice and flat across the ball of the foot. Give it a little bit of a tug so it's starting in um, a stretch position. And then your planes are flexing or pointing the toe as you contract the calf. If you go really slowly, usually you can control that band. Um, but slow is better in this case because it's kind of a rehab sort of exercise, slow strengthening. You wanna get a nice contraction of the calf as you extend that toe and then nice and slow on the way up so that you're working the entire range of motion of the calf. 